Hey guys, Fire here, bringing you another Let's Play video. This time we're checking out the Snow Fable Mystery of the Flame. This game's currently available in the Xbox Store for a price starting at $8, so uh, let's check it out. Let's see, let's. Oh, we have a cursor. I thought I could just hit A. Okay, over time. Tired and sick. The answer is going to start visitor old acquaintance. Cool. Oh, hey, look! It's a fire! That's. <laughs> so, sorry, it's kind of funny. I don't get too many, like, fire type references that I've gotten to, 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 to do so far. Okay, magic. Oh. Oh, it's a. It's a match game. Okay, got it. Destroy the given number of these tokens to complete the level. Got it. Goals for the level. Red tokens to fulfill the bar and uh, to complete the level. Okay. Got it. Let's do this. Don't tell me what to do. Let me figure it out. Uh, I need to find. I'll do what you want since you're just getting antsy with me. Okay, so we can chain things. Let's keep dropping these reds. Maybe we can get like a, a quad pairing going. Oh, what do those things do? Oh, okay, so that kind of does a line. I wonder if this just blows up. Yep, that's like a little grenade. And we did it. Okay, cool. Yeah, it's it's just like a bejeweled like kind of thing. Press A and hold the item to grab it. What? What am I supposed to do? Is this thing? Nope. Okay. Totally did the wrong thing. Uh, move a little bit here. Okay. Let's play. Okay, so we've matched Ford's tokens and I'll just create a vertical bonus. Okay, so we gotta just do greens. Okay, yeah, that, that's the vertical bonus. I wonder what makes the other bonuses, or is it random? Okay, so that, that, that makes sense. Oh, so I can swap it or activate it. Okay, that's good to know. Let's uh, keep on going here. It's got some blues we can do. We'll just uh, activate out this bonus. We just need to get greens paired, so we'll uh, keep working on that. Get some chains. Okay, that's a good chain reaction, actually. Actually, Yeah, do you guys like these, like... Uh, I want to call it Bejeweled-like games, because Bejeweled was kind of like the first game like this on, on the Xbox platform, so... These games always give me that kind of vibe that I'm playing Bejeweled. So... Oh, hey! Oh, no! I meant to chain that! Crap! Okay, what happens when we do five in a row? Okay, I want to see if we can get that, but I think we're probably going to chain a green beforehand. Yep, there, there we go. Alright, so, oh, I also, I don't know if we have move limits. I need to look and see if that number goes uh, up and down. Wow, that chained a bunch of stuff. It's still going. Oh, that's impressive. Okay. So we did that one. Press A and hold on to the item and grab it and place it on the highlighted area. I don't know... Oh! Here! But what is the highlighted area? I don't know what area is highlighted. I'm so confused. Where is there a highlighted area? Okay, I'm just going to click the menu and then adventure again. Because I don't know what the highlighted area is. But this is uh, this is definitely my, my kind of way around this. Uh, activate a bonus. Yep, I'll just double tap. That bomb's useless uh, uh, otherwise. 
so 27 moves to do this, which I think we can do. Alright, we just gotta keep getting oranges paired. So, okay, here we go. That's a good quad orange. And then we can blow that up for even more. So far, the challenges ha haven't been super tough. But I'm kind of expecting them to, uh... I guess increase in difficulty. This should clear out a good chunk of stuff. So we just need to kind of keep dropping things. There we go. Knocked that one out. So... Again, I don't know how to move things. Oh, so we did that one. Where in the world did that picture go? So I guess we're missing out on some, like, story elements for, for sure. Hey, it's a little, it's a little fire, fire guy again. Uh, as you guys know, though, if you've been on the channel for a while, I'm not the biggest fan um, of dialogue, so yeah. If you uh, want to see, uh, read the dialogue, just ha ha happily pause the video. So, let's uh, get these chains broken. Oh, I think this might be... Oh, no, we can't... Can we drop another purple down? I don't think we can. I have I've yet to get to do, like, a... Like a five-line chain. So, we need, we need to work our way to that. Alright, so we just had to break some s sticks, and it's going to give us this mushroom. Okay. So it's almost like we're building the scenery around, too. Okay, so I'm going to grab this mushroom. But again, just be very confused at not knowing where to put s said mushroom. Do I put the mushroom in the pot? Oh, I do. Okay. Where did that other thing that I got go, though? I'm s so confused. Activate bonuses to fill the spirit bar. Press on the spirit to activate and do a group at random. Oh, why? Press on... Oh. Just go up. Oh, that's like a cool little chain effect. And it looks like the game also introduced a new color on us. Uh, let's just keep kind of going here. We just need to break out these oranges. So we'll kind of focus on these for a little bit. And it would help to get the st sticks out of our weights too, just to kind of al allow more things to keep dropping. Hmm, let's keep going here. We'll drop some more of these. That gray stick is kind of a problem right now. Okay, let's do our little fire guy again. Okay, we only need a couple more oranges. So that's three right there, and then there we go. Another one kind of knocked out. Beat level five in event. Oh, this was level five. Okay. Does this just go in the cauldron too? Okay. I'm like, not everything showed like a sh sh shadow. Oh, match five or more tokens in vertical to create a rainbow bonus. Oh, okay, this is the thing I was trying to figure out what we get to make. Rainbow so that the token is every color of the same one. Okay, let's wipe all these purples. Okay, can we make another one of these soon? That, well, I think we need to try to do that. I don't know if we're going to probably get too many uh, opportunities. What's this blurred thing either. I don't know what the, that is. Maybe we can try to get some of these sticks out of here for, for us. Uh, the bomb I think will blow that up. Oh! The blurred area is just I guess a part of the map that doesn't exist. That would make a lot more sense. Okay, I need to get this bomb lowered. So I need to work on dropping these. Oh, I was really hoping... Oh, hey, we can get a red here. We can get this. And there we go. We can uh, use that five-way five, five -way one to break those sticks. That wasn't too bad. And I... You know what? I'm just going to call it here. I bet the spoon goes into the cauldron. Hey, we got our f f first achievement. O old friends. Beach chapter one. Okay. Oh, we got to save five. Oh, Pebble. 
fire and bubble. Call me Bubble. Well, I'm gonna call you Pebble anyway. Although you don't really look quite like a Pebble to me, destroy a stone tile, match token the next to it. Okay, so we'll do that to clear out areas to drop more tiles to give us more space. Makes perfect sense. Alright, let's just kind of continue the drop downs. What do you guys think? Like, did you, did you like these, like, match three kind of like, um, bejeweled like puzzle games? Or are they not kind of, not for you? Like, I'd be curious to know, like, so I'd know if I should put more videos of these kind of games out on the channel. Although, I probably will regardless, just because, you know, I li like to show all kinds of games up on the channel. But it'd be neat to know if you guys like, you know, just a change of pace when it comes to getting to play some, like, relaxing games as well. Ooh, that cleared a lot. I need to keep clearing crystals, it looks like. Oh, I just realized we almost had an opportunity for a quad. Or not a quad, but a five-piece. So, okay, yeah, we have to destroy all these crystals to keep going. Which shouldn't be too hard to do. Okay, that bomb will wipe that out. We don't have a ton of moves left, though. But this will clear out the bottom crystals. Yeah, okay, the crystals don't drop. So if we can do the quads, I think that's going to be our best chance to kind of clear these areas for us. Um, let's just get this other quad. Good, that, that's going to wipe two more. And then we just got these ones over here that need wiped. Can I drop these down anymore at all? I don't think so. Oh, but this will give us a chance to wipe one. And then we're, we're so close on these ones. Okay, this power-up will wipe this next one. Now we just got one more to do. If we can drop some purples down. I think that would... Oh, nope, this will get it. Not We only had one move left to do it. I didn't even pay attention to the move timer, so that was really close. Okay. Let's keep on going. What's the pickaxe give us? I just called it a pickaxe. Pickaxe. So sorry. My... Sh Sh Shanta rides in the corner l laughing at me. It's great, great support. Go figure. What is, where is this? Oh, I have to break those. Oh, you have to hit these twice. Oh. Okay, that makes these a little tougher. And you only get 22 moves. Okay. We need as many, like, power up things as we can get so I'm gonna be a little s slower here I think at what I pair up and match up just while I try to find what I can to score us the best combos wait okay that'll be a good bomb we kind of got a little lucky there with that clear out and this will be the end I think we got very lucky without some of the things dropped for us to have 16 moves left especially with the one beforehand we came within one of failing I am curious just to kind of glance through the achievements just for like a smidge uh, destroy tiles looks like they don't have tracking which is unfortunate and then a bunch of different uh, challenges I guess for the different modes and getting far enough in the storyline okay M -m makes enough sense. I think we might do one more a after this and then we might call it the end of the video um, But just one like I said, I want to just give you guys an opportunity to show the game off So you can kind of see what it's like. Okay, so things drop through the void. Oh Hey, maybe our spirits gonna do some good for us. I Don't know what the pebble did. I think I should have activated him instead so we'll, we'll try to get our pebble guy going here. Okay, let's, uh... We have to work on the bottom row clearouts more than a anything. And that's what's going to be a little challenging, trying to just open up our space. We do have a lot of turns, which is a little more a a advantageous for us. But it doesn't necessarily make the task at hand any easier. 
and I don't see any pairs on the bottom row. Um, so we just gotta kind of work at these. I'm gonna try to go a little back and forth, but I'm now not seeing a move. Oh, there's one up top. And I'm assuming if we can't make a move, we'll ultimately just f fail out, which would make sense, but not be the best thing for, for us. Okay, we started to get a little bit of spillover. This is good. This is key. We're at least opening up the one side. We're still struggling on the other side, which is not really what we want to be dealing with, but, you know, it kind of is what it is. Okay, I just want to keep opening that up as much as we can. Maybe we can get a chance to open up the other side. Okay, we got our little stone guy. I don't know what he does. Oh! He breaks the pieces. Okay, that's good. Um, I wanna... Ooh. I wonder if we can try to drop this blue here. That bomb's not really gonna do us any good down below, I don't think. But we'll, we'll blow this up anyway. Oh, I forgot! That's the one that takes out a color, not a bomb. Oh, that would've been really good for us to have used on that other side. Oh, I kind of missed that up. Unfortunately. Oh, that's just... There's nothing I can really do there. So, but... That do, that is kind of unfortunate that that happens. What happens with two bombs? Oh! That blew up a large area. I think that might have given us a chance to open up our other side. It is! We comboed quite a bit there. Okay, let's keep dropping these down. See if we can get any kind of wiggle room here. We don't have, like I said, a lot of turns left. So we do need to get lucky with some of these pairings that we're going to populate up here. Okay, we got to blow this row open. I don't know. I don't know if we're going to quite ma make this one. Ten moves and it's a lot we got to kind of bust through. I mean, I'm not going to give up, but at the same time, I can lose hope sometimes. Okay. We have seven moves. I don't know if it's going to happen. Unless, like I said, a lot of things need to go right our way. Uh, ooh, this might be a... Okay, that was really good for us. Let's crack all these purples. Okay, things just went really good. I don't know what two bombs in a row do. That blasts through a big area. We might have just been really lucky here, guys. Let's use our fire guy here. Maybe we'll get lucky in the areas. Okay, did we get anything near this guy? Oh, we did not. This is, uh... This is tricky. I'm gonna blow this bomb, and maybe we'll drop something near him. We did! Okay, we have this orange at the bottom. Okay. Again. Now, I guess that was actually the last move. We, sh we got lucky there with s some of this stuff again, but... Granted, I'll take luck where I can hit it. Let's uh, put this little thing on his plaque here. Oh, it like broke it open. Wow. Oh, we're talking to a pebble. There we go. All right, guys. I, I think with that being s s said, you guys kind of get the gist of the game. I just wanted to kind of show it off so you can s see what it's like. Uh, pretty fun little game. Um, out, but yeah, uh, outside of that, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did and you're new here, please consider subscribing if you haven't. And uh, maybe consider checking out one of the other videos uh, on your screen now. I hope you guys have a blessed rest of your day, and we'll catch you next time.